So, our discussion for today is set building notation. So, this is the flow of our lesson for today. First reading, second discussion, and then the examples. Greetings. Good day, everyone. May we all be blessed with God, and I hope that everyone is fine. So, let me introduce myself first. I am Princess Jeremy Sikabeko, a first year nursing student at La Consolation College. So, what is set building notation? Set building notation is defined as representation or, or notation that can be used to describe a set that is defined by a logical formula that simplifies to be true for every element of the set. It includes one or more than one variables. It is also defines a rules about the elements which belongs to the set and the elements that to common types of numbers such as integers, real numbers, and natural numbers. So before we proceed to our discussion or our examples, take note the symbols to remember. I is rich as such that E is an element of E is not an element of neg negative C set of of all negatives, positive Z, set of all positive, Z, set of all integers, and R, set of all real numbers. So, take note all of these symbols because later, magagamit natin siya sa mga examples para may mas maintindihan natin at malaman natin kung ano pa mga gamit na ito dun sa gagawin nating examples so i have here an example of set building notation given the are the notes the set of all real numbers z the set of all integers and z negative z the set of all negative integers describe each of the following sets number one set of all x element of real number r such that negative 5 is less than x and x is less than 1. Number 2. Set of all x element of integers such as negative 5 less than x and x is less than 1. Number 3. Set of all x element of negative z such as positive 1 and negative 1 less than x and x less than 1. So, sagutan natin yung number 1 which is the set of all x element of real number r such that negative 5 is less than x and x is less than 1. So, paano ko nga ba ginawa ito? Una, gagawa tayo ng... So, let's draw the line from 0. Ano nakikita niyo yung 0 dyan? 0. From 0 to negative 5. And then 0 to positive 1 and so on so far. Kaya yan lang yung nilagay ko kasi yan lang yung sakop dito sa negative 1 less than x x is less than 1 kaya lang yan lang, yan lang yung nilagay ko and then ano nga ba ang before sa negative 5 which is negative 4 0.99999 and ganun din sa 0 is a 1 positive 1 which is 0 0.99999 so ang hinahanap lang naman dito is the real number of r so the definition of r is x so ang x is ito etong negative 4.999 and 0 0.9999 and then and then kung nakikita mo 
x is less than 1, which is yun yung 0 0.9999. And dito naman sa baba, x is greater than negative 5, equals negative 4.9999. That's why, ang sagot natin dito is etong ano, the final answer is 4.9999 and 0.999 kasi ang hinahanap lang naman is the real number. So, let's go to example 2 which is the set of all x elements of integers such as negative 5 less than x, x is less than 1. So, ano nga ba nga hanapin natin dito and paano ko siya nakuha? Paano ko nakuha yung sagot? Um, una, ang hinahanap lang naman is yung integers, which is itong Z, yung may dalawang line dyan. Yan lang yung hinahanap. So, ano ba ang ano? Ano bang integers from negative 5 to positive 1? So, ito na yun. Ito na yun. It was negative 4, negative 3, negative 2, negative 1, and 0. So, therefore, the set of all integers, which is the Z, is negative 4, negative 3, negative 2, negative 1, and 0. Ganun lang siya kadali. Kaya, ito na yung final answer niya. So, dito naman tayo sa example number 3. Set of all x element of negative z such as positive 1, negative 5, less than x, and x is less than 1. So, paano ko nga din ba nakuha yung sagot dito? Paano ko nagawa to? So, ang hahanapin natin is yung negative z, which is ano yung sakop from negative 5 to positive 1. So, ano nga ba ang ano nga ba ang all negative na makukuha natin sa neg from negative 5 to positive 1. So, ito na yun. Negative 4, negative 3, negative 2, and negative 1. So, kung na tinatanong niyo ulit kung saan ko nakuha tong from negative 1, ay negative 4, negative 3, negative 2, negative 1, is nakuha ko siya dito sa from negative 5 to positive 1. Ang tinatanong lang kasi dito is, paano nga ba makukuha natin yung negative, yung all negatives? So, therefore, the set of negative z is negative 4, negative 3, negative 2, and negative 1. And the final answer is, eto na, eto ng negative 4, negative 3, negative 2, negative 1. That's all. So, that's all for today. Thank you for listening. Sana may natutunan kayo.